Kom ons eer, eer, prijs, prijs, prijs. Prijs, prijs, prijs. Wonderlijk. Dank je Heer. Dank je Heer. Kom nou mensen, kom ons in die handen bij elkaar. Prijs. Halleluja. Dank je Heer. Jij is de opkomer. Jij is de
Come on, see the year of praise. Hallelujah. 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 Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Hosanna. Hallelujah. Hosanna. Hallelujah. 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 Hey, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Can you praise God in this place? Hallelujah. Is the church here? Is the church here today? Is the church of Jesus Christ here today? Now make some noise. Let the enemy hear you. Hallelujah. Come on, clap those hands in the presence of the Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, say, Lord, you are good, say, Lord, you are good and you're blessed and you're forever. Say, Lord, you are good now. Lord, you are good and you're blessed and you're forever. Come on, point Elizabeth, say, Lord, you are good now. People from every nation and time, from generation to now, John say we worship you. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. We worship for who you are. Say we worship, we worship you. Come on, jump to the presence of the Lord. Yeah. 
can't hear you. All the town say, and all the town say, you are good. Say, you are good. All the time, all the town say, say, you are good. We're talking about Jesus here all the time. Say it again. You are good. You are good all the time. Hey, all the time. Lord, you are good in your mercy and your endurance forever. I need you to raise your voice and say, Lord, you are good. And your mercy endures forever. The Bible says, if my people who are called by my name, say, Lord, you are good. And your mercy. Raise your voice, church of the Lord. Say, Lord, you are good. you done but for who you are Lord you are good we worship you hallelujah 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 we worship you for who you are for who you For he is good, yeah. We worship you, oh God, yes. You believe that every praise belongs to him this afternoon? Oh, say, every praise, come on, is to our God. And every word of worship with one accord. Every praise, every praise, every praise, every praise. It's to our God. Oh, sing hallelujah. Sing hallelujah. To our God. Glory hallelujah. Glory, hallelujah. Yeah. It's to our God. Every praise. Every praise. Every praise. Every praise. It's to our God. We just sing every praise, oh God. Every praise, hey. It's to our God. Every word, every word of worship. Every praise, every praise, every praise is to our God. Sing hallelujah, say, sing hallelujah to our God. Glory hallelujah, every praise, every praise, every praise is to our God. Oh, we say. Every word, every word of worship with water, every praise, every praise, every praise is to our God. Sing hallelujah, say, sing hallelujah. It's to our oh God. Sing hallelujah. Say, sing hallelujah to our oh glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's to our God. Every praise. Every praise. Every praise. Every praise. It's to our oh
Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. God, my Savior. Yeah. Yeah. He's so Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he Just when you think of my Savior, God. God, my Savior. He is. Yes, he is. God, my He's your so deliverer. God, my deliverer. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Come on, Nelson Mandela, baby, you say, He's God, my. He's your healer. He's your deliverer, yeah. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. God, my Savior, God, my. Yeah, yeah. He's your deliverer. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Every praise, every praise is to our everyone. Every praise, every praise is to our God. Sing hallelujah, yeah. Sing hallelujah. It's to our God. One more time, every praise, every praise, hey, every praise, hey. It's to our God. Oh, every word of worship. With one accord. Every praise. Every praise. Every praise. Every praise. It's to our God. God. Hallelujah. We worship you. Come on, give God a shout of praise. Come on, lift your voice now, Sir Mandela Bay. Just lift it up right where you are. Give him a shout of praise. So come on, lift your voice over the city. Lift it up, lift it up. Give him praise. High praise this afternoon. We are to exalt him. Come on, you don't have to stop this afternoon, right? We are just, let's pray, let's pray. Come and lift it up in this place. Let's lift it up. Lift your voices. Come on, this is the day of the Lord. This is His day. Come on. Come on, come on. Lift your voices, man. Come on, pray right where you are. Come on, let's fill the square. Let's fill the square this afternoon. Lift your praises right across the square. Come on. Come on. Chaba, Sire, 
there is power in the name of Jesus who believes that there is power there is power in the name of Jesus there is power in the name of Jesus just look to the heavens and see that there is power in the name of Jesus he made the heavens and the earth and we come under one name today to sing there is power
Just sing it out, just the voices. There's. There's an army rising up. There's an army rising up. Come on. To break every chain. Break every chain. Break every. <laughs> to break every chain. Break every chain. Break every sing. We're the army. We're the army rising. Oh, the Port Elizabeth. We're the army. Yeah, we're an army. Right. Prophesy of yourself. You're the army. We're the army rising. Break 
can preach it. Yes, Lord, we bless you. Bless you, Jesus. Just bless his name. Bless his name. We bless you, Lord. There is no one like you, Jesus. We bless your name. We declare, Lord, that we are hungry. We are hungry for an encounter. We are hungry, Jesus. We are hungry for your presence. We hunger for Port Elizabeth to be revived, to be revived. Come and bring revival, Lord. We give you all the glory. We worship you. to be Oh, we worship you, King of Kings. We give you you we worship you our Lord. you are worthy to be great. we just lift up the name above every other name right now we voice and declare we give We give you all in this place right now. We give you, we 
Do you believe it this afternoon? We say, because we sing hallelujah. Oh, yeah. We sing hallelujah. We sing hallelujah. The Lamb is over the And we sing hallelujah. And we sing hallelujah. And we sing hallelujah. Lift your voice and declare, because we sing. Lift it up in this place. Just declare the name of Jesus right where you are right now. Lift the name of Jesus over this place. The name of Jesus, a banner over our municipality, over the Nelson Mandela Bay. There is no other name. The city of hope, city of hope, city of hope, 
city of hope, the city of hope, the city of hope, the city of hope. Lift it up in this place. His name is Jesus. There is no other name. Hey. Hearts on fire, unity to inspire. Good evening, good afternoon. The Lord bless you. God richly, richly, richly bless you. Can we put our hands together for PEFM, for hosting, for doing their part, uniting the body of Christ together. For greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. Jesus, we give you the glory. I need to hear you give Jesus the greatest praise, the greatest glory belongs to Him. Hallelujah! To God be the glory for the great things He has done. There's nobody like you, Jesus. Look to somebody next to you. Cake na iman. Check Wiki 8. And then you say to them, when they ask you, why are you so blessed? Lift your finger heavenward and say, Nobody but God. Nobody but God. When they ask you, why are you so blessed? Lift your finger heavenward and say, Nobody but God. Nobody but God. I, 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 see, I see some of you go like this. Nobody but God. Okay. Come on now. When they ask you why are you so blessed, lift your finger heavenward and say, Nobody but God. Nobody but God. Nobody but God. Now give God your best praise. He deserves it. He's wonderful. He's glorious. Can you put your hands together also to welcome our listeners as we are connected to the radio stations, internet, live streaming. Can you welcome the audience that will join us for the whole session. God bless you. Before I share with us the importance of Ascension Day, firstly I want to thank God for all the men of God, the women of God that have come together to make this event a success. Amen. Can you give all the women and men of God a hand of praise? Much work. Every church that has come together, we were more than 100 leaders that have come together. This is not going to be a once-off event. This is going to be an every day, every year event, reclaiming the power of the ascended Christ. Now, we're not here to reclaim anything. We are here to celebrate our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. We are here to give God the glory that He deserves. Amen? Then we want to thank God especially also for the radio station and also the contribution that they have made over this period of time. To everybody who has spent a lot of time committing to this time, can we give them a hand of praise as well? You're going to find that all the men of God, some of them, all of them have a little red armband. When we pray, we are here to pray the blessing of God over our metro and to trust God for the prosperity of the kingdom and also to have good governance in our city. Amen. We want to trust God. So when we break up in the areas of prayer, I want you to join with the ministers. They're just going to trust God. We are not here to play games. We are here to break open the heavens, to destroy strongholds, principalities, and powers. will know that there is the Christ, the Son of the living God. Ascension Day. Today I trust God that it will be a day in which we will have worldwide, countrywide, 
days of reclaiming the power to pray for our cities, our neighborhoods, and also to trust God to break the scourge of crime, break the scourge of gangsterism, break the scourge of corruption, and that the glory of God will be seen in a time such as this. The evidence of Ascension Day Never forget, number one, there is no Pentecost without Ascension Day. Jesus said, except I go to be with the Father, I cannot send you the Holy Ghost. So it's important for us to know we will not get the job done without the Holy Spirit. We need the Spirit of the living God. Programs are great, but it's the presence of God that will make a difference in your home, your family, your children. They must know the power of the supernatural presence of the Lord God Almighty. Amen. Can you give me a strong amen? That, that is not Pentecostal. It's just in our way of saying, God, let it be so. Amen. Number two, the ascended Christ gave gifts to men. There'll be no gifts like the apostle, the prophet, the pastor, the evangelist without Christ ascending. The ascended gifts of Christ is so that you and I can finish our job. God called us in the earth to finish it and to finish it strong. To finish it in the power of God, in the power of the Spirit of the living God. Number three, when Christ ascended, the Bible said He was seated at the right hand of God the Father. That is a governmental position. That is why you will find that if you ignore Ascension Day, you will find rebellion will take the place of everything. But with Christ ascended, chaos is under control. There is nothing that is not under God's control. In fact, He's the only God I know that moves from darkness to light, moves from poverty to riches, moves from death to life and look how good you look today who would have thought that you would come out in a midday week in the way you have you got to give yourselves a hand of praise today it's going to get better it's going to be greater because of the unity of the body of christ reclaiming ascension day is reclaiming our governmental authority at the same time we are not here to compete with anybody. We are here to complete what God has called us to complete. Amen. The ascension of Christ was celebrated on the 40th day after Calvary. It's very important for us to understand that. You see, with every 40th day, a generation is about to be shifted. A generation is 40 years. That's why even a woman, when she falls pregnant, it takes 40 weeks before freshness comes. We are about to see freshness enter our city, see freshness enter our metro. It's about time. That's why it's been so difficult. It's been difficult. I don't know how many men are pregnant, but I'm pregnant today. I'm pregnant to see another generation rise up in the power of God, rise up in the anointing of God, and do things that are impossible. Amen. The ascension on the 40th day. Remember, it was 40 days and 40 nights Noah had a flood. I want to tell you, after the flood, a new earth was birthed. 40 days later, a new earth was birthed. Today, I declare over our metro, a new day is about to be birthed. Can a city be saved and born again in one day? The answer is yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. And then lastly, that's why you see we can't afford to leave Ascension Day just to be removed. No, no, we got to celebrate this day so that we can have what God has called us to have. Amen. Now there's one thing about Ascension Day that excites me. That I, that's why I don't give up and I never give in. We've come too far to turn back now. If Jesus is dead... If he is dead, go shopping. If he is dead and he's not been raised to life again, you are wasting your time. But he who ascended, the same Jesus that you saw ascend, will in like manner return. Will in like manner return. He's coming 
and he's not going to delay his coming. Jesus is still faithful to his word. He is coming. He is coming. Turn to somebody next to you and tell them he's coming. Come on, prophesy. He's coming. Jesus is coming. Jesus is coming. Hallelujah. Wow. 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 And then that devil's got to get the message. He's not coming for me. He's coming for every human being, every son, every daughter. And I tell you today, nobody is going to stay in bondage under our watch. This generation will rise up. We'll bring deliverance. We will preach this gospel. We will declare freedom to all of mankind. Because in the name of Jesus, we are followers of Christ. We are followers of the Messiah, the Christ, the Son of the living God. Let me tell you something. If Jesus, if Jesus preached, we will preach. If Jesus taught the Word of God, we will teach the Word of God. If Jesus cast out devils, we will cast out devils. If the early church brought deliverance, we are of that generation. We will not leave any devil unchallenged, any devil not to be moved, but we declare it in the name of Jesus the Christ. Mountain, move. Mountain, move. Come on, activate it with me. Mountain, 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 in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, mountain move, mountain move. Now give God your best shout of praise. Hallelujah. Glory to God. 87.6 To license it. 87.6 Jou ginsteling radiostasie, 87.6. BFM. BFM 87.6, waar ons streef om God te eer, om te ken en bekend te maak aan die stad van Port Elisabeth. Good afternoon everybody. Do you know why we're here? We are to pray and to bless our city. And we're going to start this afternoon by praying for families. So this afternoon, right where you are, can we join our hands and hearts together? And we're going to pray and trust God to bless our families. Come on, church, let's join our hearts in prayer this afternoon. Father, this afternoon, we thank you. We thank you that you have blessed us with families, oh God. That family is not a man-made idea. Family is a God idea. Families come from you, Lord God. And you promised Abram, oh God, in you all the families of the earth shall be blessed. In you all the families of the earth shall be blessed. And in us we bless our families of the metro, oh God. We bless our families of Nelson Mandela Bay, oh God. We call upon you, Father God, and we thank you this afternoon, Father, for your blessing for all our families. In the West, we say our families are blessed. Somebody shout amen. In the South, we say our families are blessed. Amen. In the East, we say our families are blessed. Amen. In the north, we say our families are blessed. Amen. Your word declares, Lord, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved. You and your whole family. You and your whole family. You and your whole family. Declare it, church. Declare it. You and your whole family. You and your whole family. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We declare salvation.
visitation over every family. We declare deliverance over every family. We declare healing over every family. We declare blessing over every family. Father, this afternoon, we lift up every father, every head of the home, oh God. We pray that fathers will rise up. We speak to every father, rise and shine. For your light has come. And the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. We declare our fathers are godly. Our fathers are blessed. We declare our fathers are wise. Raise up men, O God. We'll become godly fathers in our city, O God. We bless our fathers, O God. Father, this afternoon we come up against the spirit of divorce in the name of Jesus. We bind the spirit of divorce in the name of Jesus. We break your power and we drive you out of our families in the name of Jesus. We come up against the spirit of adultery in the name of Jesus. We bind your power in the name of Jesus. And we drive you out of our city in the name of Jesus. Father, this afternoon we come up against the spirit of abuse. We bind your power. We bind your power. You have no hold over our families. We drive you out of our families in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray for our children, oh God. We lift up our sons and our daughters, oh God. We lift up our young men and our young women, oh God. Pour out the Holy Ghost. Pour out the Holy Ghost. Pour out the Holy Ghost. Sons and daughters, receive the Holy Ghost. Young men, receive the Holy Ghost. Young women, receive the Holy Ghost. Our families are full of the Holy Ghost, oh God. Hallelujah. Our families are blessed. Our families are blessed. All together, Heavenly Father, we declare Acts chapter 16, verse 31. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved. You and your whole household. Because I am saved. My whole family is saved. Because I am saved. My whole family is delivered. Because I am saved. My whole family is healed. For your glory. For your glory. For your glory. Hallelujah. Let's give God a shout of victory. Hallelujah. Seven point six, where we aspire to honor God, to know Him, and to make Him known to the city of Port Elizabeth. We enter your gates with thanksgiving. We enter your courts with praise. We declare that you are omnipresent, you are omnipotent, you are an omniscient God. You are an amazing God, and we look to you this afternoon. We proclaim that you alone are Jehovah, the God Almighty. There is none like you, O Lord God Almighty. We have no other God but you in this city. Therefore, we lift up our holy hands before you as we stand in the gap for government. We pray your word says in Isaiah 9 verse 6, For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulders, and his name shall be called Wonderful, the Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. And therefore this day we stand in the executive offices. We pray for the 
head of the state. We pray for the head of government. We pray for our president, Mr. Ramaphosa. And we declare and we decree that he will lead with integrity. That the fear of the Lord will be upon him. We bring our legislators before you, O God. Our national assembly, our national cause of provinces. We declare that no evil will prevail in our legislation. Our legislators will be bold in the rule of righteousness and that the fear of God will be upon them. And we declare for our judicious, we pray for our constitutional courts, we pray for our supreme courts, we pray for our high courts, and we declare that the fear of God will be upon them. And we know that you are the supreme God you alone are God and we pray that truth and righteousness will prevail and we declare and decree in our government no evil shall prevail no ungodliness shall prevail we declare and we decree as the righteous of God we take on a shape and we say your will be done in our government your kingdom come in the name of Jesus you are the ruler you are our God when an enemy comes up like a flood the spirit of the Lord God Almighty will raise up the standard raise the standard in our government raise the standard oh Lord our eyes are on you our focus is on you and we thank you we declare that it is done we declare that righteous government has arrived in the name of jesus and we thank you in the name of jesus we pray well i'm back Folk, you know, one of the most wonderful and powerful things is, I just, it's my privilege, I just, the mayor, can we put our hands together as he just welcomes us to the, to this part of the city, sir. Thank you very much, Pastor. Good afternoon and good early evening to everyone. Thank you very much for your prayers. On behalf of our city, we are, still, we are saying to you, keep on praying for us. Keep on praying for us. Keep on praying for your government so that the crime can come to an end. Keep on praying for us so that we can employ more people. Keep on praying. Keep on praying. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. Can we just lift our hands? Can we just lift our hands, Evan Word, just for a moment? Father, we come right now and we declare that it shall be so. We declare that upon every counselor, every, every civil servant, your power, your wisdom, and your might will come mightily. Bless the first citizen. Bless him. Bless them in the work that they have to accomplish. We give you all the glory. Can we give Jesus a praise offering right now? God bless you. The Bible says... If my people that are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray, turn from their wicked ways and seek my face, God says, I shall hear in heaven and I shall heal their land. Church, we are standing here because the Bible tells us that we have a weapon that is not a physical weapon, but we have weapons that are mighty to demolish strongholds and right now together I'm going to ask us to hold hands and I'm going to ask that you pray in your own way in your own language I want you to pray and lift up your voice we are praying for the spirit of prayer to consume our city Nelson Mandela Bay to be consumed by a revival of prayer remember unless we pray nothing changes we are going to pray for a few things. We are going to pray that we have less talk and more prayer. 
We are going to pray for the prayer atmosphere in every church that the young, the children's church, the adults, everyone will be consumed by prayer. We are praying for the spirit of prayer in the private space, in the public space. We are praying for consistent prayer. Remember the Bible says the fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much. And so we are going to pray. We are going to pray for the Holy Spirit direction that we will be sensitive to know what we pray for. That we will not just pray in the natural, but the church will arise and begin to pray in the spirit. Because when we are praying in the spirit, we are praying in the heavenly language and we are praying straight prayers that hit the target. Can we take three minutes in the remaining three minutes that I have? Let's lift up our voices. Let us pray for the spirit of prayer to come over our city. Come on, everyone lift up your voice. Father, in the name of Jesus, we are standing to go to over this market square and we are demanding the spirit of prayer over our city. We are speaking it forth. We are declaring it in the name of Jesus. We are speaking to the atmosphere. We say atmosphere you shift right now in the name of Jesus. We release a fresh dose, a fresh passion for prayer. The children of God will pray in the name of Jesus. We will pray in the morning. We will pray in the noontime. We will pray at midnight. The spirit of prayer come over our city. Rabashaka, Ribasa Kete, Rokobo Sataya, Ribasa Kete, Rokobo Siende, in the name of Jesus, Tululim Fuselelo, Yom Tandaso, Pazwen Nelson Mandela Pay, Amabancha, Mawatandas, let the churches pray in the name of Jesus. We speak united prayer, kingdom prayer in the name of Jesus. We will stand together as one, we will pray and Until something happens, we will pray in the name of Jesus. We will pray for those in power. We will pray for our leaders. We will pray in the name of Jesus. We will pray for the righteous to ascend. And we will pray for the unrighteous to descend in the name of Jesus. Oh, come on and come on. Release the spirit of prayer. We speak it. Prayer is in the atmosphere. We will pray in the corridors at work. We will pray in the kitchen. We will pray in the bedrooms. We will pray everywhere. We will pray in our churches. The young will pray. The youth shall pray. In the name of Jesus, the Lord said it, that in the last days, I will pour out my spirit. Father, pour out your spirit of prayer. Propel our messages. Propel the preachings through prayer. We declare it. We are a praying city. We are a praying nation. In the name of Jesus, even as prayer was done in Parliament, Lord, we believe that comes from the throne room of heaven. Prayer, 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 and more prayer, and prayer will release it. Let it be in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, come on and declare hallelujah in this place. Oh, come on and declare hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. The spirit of the living God is all over this place. They're watching us, by the way, from Norway and Seychelles and all over the world are watching this meeting. I wonder, I won't be long. I want to teach you something very quickly. Acts chapter 2, verse 32. God raised Jesus from the dead, and we are witness of, witnesses of this. And we are witnesses of this. Now he is exalted to the place of highest honor in heaven at God's right hand. And the Father, as he promised, gave him the promised Holy Spirit to pour out upon us just as you have seen and heard. I'm here to tell you, 
we tongue-talking Pentecostals are a living testimony that Jesus Christ is not in the grave, but that he is risen. Peter said, listen to me very carefully, because I need to say this. I've got five minutes and I want to say it. I'm expecting people with blind eyes to see right now. I'm expecting deaf ears to pop open. I'm expecting people to throw their crippled uh, uh, crutches away and get out of their wheelchairs and walk right here as a, a testimony to the power of the living God. And they had drawn a crowd. We got a bigger crowd than them. I think there's 4,000, 5,000. They only had 3,000, although only 3,000 got saved. Maybe there were more, but anyway, I digress. He said, you know what you're seeing? We're talking in other tongues. People say it's nonsense. You're just talking gibberish. But they were talking in different languages. People understood them. One day in my church, we had a member of our church called Andrew von Ryan who had a pituitary gland problem and was dying in agony when one of my pastors fetched him to my office and I had a prayer meeting with calls of pastors. And as he walked in and the doctors had said, you'll die in agony. As he walked in, the power of God came on me and I began to pray for him in Corsa that I've never learned and he was instantly healed and he's still alive today as an evidence. Now listen to me. What did Peter say? He said, you see these people supernaturally speaking in tongues. It's because Jesus ascended to the th right hand of the Father and poured out the Holy Ghost. So Pentecostals, when you talk in tongues, you are telling the world. You're telling the demons. You're declaring before God, our God is alive. Our God is alive. I want to quote one other verse, verse 17. Get a load of this. God said, in the last days, I will pour out my spirit on all flesh. That started on the day of Pentecost. Now listen to me. Jesus died for every sinner. Every sinner. They have to repent to be saved, but his blood was shed for them. Now listen to me. God, I don't ask God, oh God, send the Holy Ghost on this crowd. He said, I have poured out my spirit on all flesh. You know what we have to do? We don't beg God for another outpouring. We must take our umbrellas down and obey the Holy Ghost. Amen. Let me give you one last illustration. You remember Jacob's son Joseph died. He was put in a pit and his father thought he was dead. But he went to Egypt and ended up on the right hand of the king's throne. Do you know what I'm speaking of? He's a type of Jesus. And the old man was crying and weeping all the years. His favorite son was dead until he suddenly heard the sound of wagons filled with gifts coming from Egypt. And they, he said, what is this? They said, your son is not dead. He's not only alive. He's on the right hand of authority. Listen to me. Listen to me tonight, this morning, this afternoon. Listen to me. The gifts of the Holy Ghost declared to me, Jesus is not in the grave. He's alive. And I hear, you know what I hear? I hear the sound of the wagons from heaven bringing the gifts of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can you hear? Can you hear? Can you hear? If you get healed, come and talk to these guys in the year. Come out here. Tell them about it. 
Come out if you've got healed. If your ear opened at any time in the service. Come out here if your, your, your broken foot healed. I don't care what it is. Throw your crutch away. Get out of your wheelchair. I command you in Jesus' name. I was meditating on this word to bring to you. When my, when my one pastor, Marianne, runs into my office and she's shouting and weeping. And I'm going to tell you that the gifts and the miracles of God are evidence that he rose out the grave and that he ascended to pour out his gifts on us. Raise your hand and say, I receive the gifts. We got a lady in our church. Her name is Vilma van Jerden. I can introduce you to her. This is not a story. She got cancer. They cut one of her lungs out. And then when they'd finished, they said, we're sorry. You have eight months to live and you're going to die. That's what the doctor said. And we prayed for her. You see, the the wagon of God's blessing has come to us. It's come to every church that believes God. We prayed for Vilma. And Marianne comes running in and screaming and she got her, her cell phone on loudspeaker and Vilma is crying and screaming. She said, I've just been to the doctor. Pastor Jimmy, you prayed for me two weeks ago and they can't find any cancer. It's all God. Cancer! Hallelujah, cancer! You die now! Cancer, you die now! Demons, you bow your knee now! We have the gifts of the Holy Spirit to, to verify Jesus is alive. You know what I want you to do now? I think that most of you are spiritful Christians. I want you to do what they did at Pentecost and 3,000 got saved. I want you to start letting the wagon roll. I want you to, I want every spiritual child of God to say, Lord, I'm not begging you. I've, you poured it out. I receive it. I want you to raise your hands and I want you to start shouting out in other tongues. I want you to speak a heavenly language now. Karababa bayeto robobonda manda yeto babara babara bandara bashaka handa ora baba haye ora baba yesu ora baba yetada come on pray tongues pray tongues pray tongues pray tongues karaba shadara banda ora baba bora boshalara baraba handa ora baba yesu I hear the sound of the wagons. Our oh, Jesus is alive. He's on the right hand of the Father and he sent the Holy Ghost. He sent the Holy Ghost. Take hands. I'm going to be finished in two minutes. I began weeping when I began, I know Vilma personally. I began weeping that the Lord had healed given up to die, no hope, but Jesus healed her. You know what the Lord said to me? He said, I let it happen today so you could go to that big crowd and say, I hear the sound. I hear the sound of the miracle power of a loving God. Can you hear the sound? He is risen. He is resurrected. He is ascended. He is exalted on high. Take hands, every child of God in this place. You don't have to beg the Holy Spirit down. We don't have to beg him to move right now. He's poured his spirit out on all flesh. I think he poured out his spirit on, on Hitler and Mussolini and, and all of these men. He poured out his spirit on but we have got to accept it and obey and believe. Without it, we get nothing from God. And we will go to, we will miss out. I want everybody to pray this with me. Let's shout it out that all of heaven hears. Say, Father, we are here 
on ascension day to receive the gifts of God's power and love in our minds, in our families, in our city, in everything we do. In Jesus' name, we command every demon to fly. Get out. I see in the spirit, I see demons. I can see them fleeing out of here. They're going, they're going. Demons of sickness. They're going, they're going, they're going. Hallelujah. Praise God, man. Hallelujah. Power of God is they falling out under the power in the front here. That is an evidence. It's an evidence. He's risen. He is risen. People are falling out under power. It's an evidence. What you see and hear is because he rose, he ascended, and he poured out his spirit. And that's the evidence that he's alive today. Has anybody had a miracle? You had a miracle in your body. You sense you were healed. Why won't you, won't you come out of the crowd? We won't embarrass you. Come forward. I'm going to give you a few seconds. If you don't come right now, we can't stand waiting for you. He says, somebody says, my eye open, my deaf ear open, my, my lungs open. Is anybody come here quickly? Don't be shy. You know what? I'm not going to beg you. But you're going to miss out on sharing what Jesus did for you. I say in closing, if he didn't ascend and get seated on the right hand of the Father, we would have never had the gifts of the Holy Ghost. And you can find out for Vilna van Jeden, she had eight months to live, and they can't find a cell, a cancer cell in her body from the head to her toe. I'm here to tell you that same Jesus, that same spirit is here. Take the gift. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. We're going to go back into that song, There is Power. We're just going to sing and just tell the Holy Spirit He's welcome here first. Holy Spirit, you are welcome here. Come flood this place and fill the atmosphere. Your glory, God, is what our hearts long for, to be Just tell Moyo and Wele. Moyo and Wele. Holy Spirit, you are welcome. Here. You're welcome. Come, Come flood this place and fill the atmos. Your glory, God, is what our hearts long to be. Close your eyes. Just put your face on Jesus. Your presence. Just your presence. Your presence, Lord. Just put your face against Jesus' face. Your presence, Lord. Let's just sing it one more time. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, you are welcome. You're so welcome. Come flood this place and fill the atmosphere. Your glory, God, is what our hearts long for. To be overcome by 
We just worship God for His presence here. I think Apostle felt there was a particular anointing as we sung, there is power in the name of Jesus. So we're just going to go back into this song and just prophetically declare it over this, over this nation and over the city. start. We're going to sing this in three languages again. And we are going to make this declaration because something broke when we sung this over our city. Because there is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power Jesus to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. Oh, I can feel the joy rising. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power. Jesus to break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power. Break every chain, come on, dance. To break every chain, come on, let's get free. Break every chain. To break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. Oh, you'll break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. You'll break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. I want to just encourage you. We believe we're free. The Word says that we should dance. I want to invite you to move. Let the chains come off today. Express yourself. We're going to sing this in Corsa. Come on, where my cross home slobber's arms? Kukohamala, Hegemeni Lika Jesu. Come on, sing it out. Kaula, okay, I'm a chain. I'm a chain. I'm a chain. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kaula, okay, I'm a chain. I'm a chain. I'm a chain. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kaula, okay, I'm a chain. I'm a chain. I'm a chain, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a chain, I'm a chain, I'm a chain, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kuko amala, kuko amala. Come on, kuko amala. Ege meni liga Jesus. Come on, kuko amala. Amachena, Amachena, 
shift there is power something's changing in the atmosphere sit it heal the name of Jesus we worship you Jesus to break every chain break every chain but I seek it come on last time we're gonna sing it in Afrikaans do we believe that our God can unify us? Do we believe that our King? John 17 says, Father, may they be one as you and I are one. We sing and pray in accordance with our Christ, the living God. Taurus Krach and Dina for Jesus. Taurus Krach. Daar is kracht. Daar is in the name of Jesus, there is power. There is power. In the name of Jesus, there is power. There is power. In the name of Jesus, come on, the kids are so brave. The kids are so brave. The kids are so brave. Come on, the kids. The kids are so brave. Die There's an army rising. There's an army, say, there's an army rising. Just look around you at this army. There's an army rising up to break every chain, break every chain. Break every chain. 
Can we sing, we are the army? We are the army rising up. We raise our hands to our King. We are the army rising up. We are the army. We are the army rising up. To break every chain. To break every chain. Break every chain, oh! To break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. We are the army. We are the army rising up. Come on, just the drums, just the drums. We are the army rising up. Hey, 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 hey. We are the army. Rising hey, hey, up hey, hey, hey. to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. To break every chain, break every chain, break every. Come on, let's just get in for the last few minutes here. A bit of warfare mode. We're gonna stick on the drums here. I feel like we need to push in, sing this over the city. Of the army rising up. Come on, sing it again, the demonic. We are the army rising up. The army of Jesus. We are the army rising up. Yeah! To break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. Break every chain, 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 break every chain. Come on, let's give the Lord a shout. You are worthy, Jesus. You are worthy, Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody give the Lord some praise. Come on, shout unto the Lord with a voice of triumph, for He has done marvelous things. Hallelujah. Port Elizabeth, we want to say thank you for coming to this wonderful, awesome day. Hallelujah. Jesus has ascended on high and is seated at the right hand side of God the Father. May God bless you. May God bless the city of Port Elizabeth in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. On behalf of the organizers and the fathers of the city, we want to say thank you for coming out today. We thank God for blessing us in the name of Jesus. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. The Lord make His face shine upon you. The Lord are gracious unto you. The Lord lift up His countenance over you. You will be the hearer of good news and not of bad news. Good news will find you. Good news will come to you. Good news will be on your phone. Good news are coming to the city of Port Elizabeth in the name of Jesus because of the ascended Christ because of who he is because he's the king of kings and the lord of lords good news are coming to the city of Port Elizabeth you don't need to fear the fear of the night nor the arrow that fly by day you will not fear because God is your protector he will keep you he will protect you he will give angels charge concerning you to keep you on all your ways may God richly bless you where are you just before you leave can you hear the can you hear the wagons bringing the gifts just tell the people quickly what Jesus did in this crowd today listen I tell you God just touched me from my acute back problem I had x-rays yesterday I got growth on the back of my spine and I just I just sent God power coming on me and then the next moment I, I'm free I can do it there's no pain and there's no 
God is good. God does what he promises. I told you, we are the evidence. He's risen and he's exalted. Hallelujah. And I hear the sound of the wagons. He's bringing you the blessing. Come on, somebody, give the Lord praise. The Lord is your banner. The Lord is your provider. The Lord is the one that will bless you. The Lord is the one that will keep you. The protector of heaven and earth is the one that will protect you. Hallelujah. That's an open heaven. That's an open heaven. Blessing is coming to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Be blessed. Be honored. Be blessed in the name of the Lord Jesus. God is bringing Good news to the city of PE in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Taras Niman. Taras Niman. Taras Niman. Niman Swazay. Taras Niman. Taras Niman. Taras Niman. Niman Swazay. Hey lady von Dasi, hey make it your own. Say name Jesus, that is my man. So say, hey lady von Dasi, hey make it your own. Say name Jesus, that is my man. So say, that is my man. That is my man. Tarus ni ma, ni ma tuze. 